Hi everyone and welcome back to our Involved Asia and Cryptocurrency YouTube channel. Today's video is about XDC, Singfin Network, ISO 222 compliant cryptocurrency. Now our main point of discussion in this video is to do a tutorial on how we can download the XDC wallet to our mobile phones so that we can have an alternative way on how we can hold or store our XDC coin cryptocurrency holdings without a hardware wallet or a ledger wallet. Okay, so before we move on, always remember that all the information on this website is published in good faith and for general information purpose only. And any action that you take upon the information you find on our Involved Asia and Cryptocurrency YouTube channel is strictly at your own risk, okay? For additional information, we're recording this video today, uh, August 16, 2022, at 3.16 a.m. Philippine time or Manila time. And as of the recording of this video, price action of XDC, 1 XDC is equal to 0 0.3547 uh, cents in dollar uh, denomination. It's currently down by 0.74% in the past 24 hours. So considerably a good buying opportunity, especially if you're doing DCA or dollar cost average. Okay. Now, uh, for example, we have this situation wherein we don't own a ledger or a hardware wallet and we want to take out our XDC holdings from a cryptocurrency exchange and find an alternative means on how to hold or store our XDC. Uh, based on my uh, research, we can uh, resolve this issue by installing the XDC open source uh, wallet. Uh, we can download this straight from the XDC website. So we're now on the CoinMarketCap website and all we need to do is to click on a website and select uh, www.singfin.org uh, official uh, website of XDC Singfin Network. Okay, when you click on this link, uh, we will be redirected to the official website of uh, Singfin network or xdc Singfin network where we can find the download link this is the legitimate download link of the xdc open source wallet or simply the xdc wallet okay so if we click on open source wallet here this is the direct link where we can download the xdc wallet okay now we're recording this video using a desktop computer for a better viewing experience for this uh, uh, XDC tutorial. Uh, definitely, uh, you can replicate uh, doing the same step and install your XDC wallet on your uh, mobile phones, okay? And the best thing is that I managed to record the uh, installation process of my XDC wallet on my own mobile phone, and I will share this video to you, okay? Based from what we can see here, I have successfully installed my XDC wallet on my mobile phone and I downloaded it from the uh, XDC legitimate uh, website. Okay, so I'm opening and I'm accessing the XDC um, app right now and I'm about to create my XDC wallet. Okay, so the first step will be to create your own PIN. Uh, this is a four-digit PIN, so... I would suggest to create a four-digit pin that uh, contains random numbers and you can easily remember at the same time. So the next step is that you'll need to confirm your pin. So just retype your uh, four-digit pin. Okay, we will be redirected on the next page and there's uh, a prompt or a reminder saying XDC wallet does not hold your keys for you. We cannot access accounts, recover keys, reset passwords, nor reverse transactions. So store your private key at safe place by going to export private key menu. Okay, so you can click on close and then this is the XDC dashboard. 
Uh, right off the bat, we can see the main token list, which are XDC or XDC mainnet, XDC testnet, and XDC E or XDC uh, ERC20. And we also have uh, Ethereum coin here. So aside from XDC coin, we also have other coins and tokens supported by the XDC wallet. Meaning, aside from XDC, we can also uh, hold or keep other tokens and coins on this XDC wallet, okay? As long as they're supported. And in the lower part of the page, uh, you can see here uh, home, home or the dashboard and then send option, receive option, and then uh, transactions. Okay, so on the upper uh, left-hand corner, if you click on the three lines, uh, this is the part where you can see the settings option. And we have here the security tab, the app, and about section. Okay, so under security, we have change pin and then export private key. Before I uh, deposited uh, some amount of XDC on my XDC wallet, I tried to log out first. The log out button is on the lower part of the uh, settings of the XDC wallet. Uh, when I tried to log out and entered my uh, four digit pin, the XDC wallet. Uh, immediately ask me to enter my private key. Okay, so since I already have my private key, I tried to input my private key again and I was able to prove to myself that I can gain access again to my XDC wallet as long as I have my four-digit pin and my XDC wallet private key. Okay, and another uh, main an important option here is to set your default currency. So by default, the XDC wallet is set up in US dollar. So I'm located in the Philippines or in Manila territory. So I can set this one to peso denomination. Okay, so for both our Filipino and foreign uh, viewers and subscribers, uh, that's uh, another uh, basic yet important and helpful information you can know. In my case, based on my experience, since I have already tried to log out and log in again on my XDC wallet and gain uh, access. I'm able to prove that it's uh, going to work as long as you have your private key. But uh, whenever I try to log in and, and access my XDC wallet on my mobile, I no longer log out every time I access my XDC wallet. I just uh, log in using my PIN and then I just close my... Uh, XDC wallet right away without logging out and uh, I'm able to always have access to my XDC wallet, okay? And since this is running on your mobile phone, uh, always remember to refrain clicking any uh, unknown or suspicious links uh, sent on your mobile phone or uh, spam emails received on your uh, nominated email clients on your mobile just to uh, have that security and always uh, practice uh, running your antivirus uh, applications on your mobile phone, okay? So, for example, you're going to export your private key. Uh, you will be asked to uh, log in again using your four-digit PIN, okay? Okay, so I tried to uh, click on export private key. I was asked to enter my uh, four-digit PIN. Now I have my private key. And I have an option to export my private key now. Okay, so in our example, what I did was to export my private key on my uh, nominated email addresses. Uh, you, you always have an option to simply uh, take a picture or uh, write your uh, XDC uh, wallet pin and XDC private key on a journal. So, for example, you've uh, taken a photo of your uh, XDC wallet pin or XDC wallet uh, private key. After writing it down on a journal, I would suggest to delete the uh, photo for security and privacy reasons. Okay, so I'm sending my uh, private key on my nominated email addresses and I was asked to enter my pin again. Okay, and then I'm going back to the... Uh, dashboard after retrieving all important information. Okay, so we're now, I, I'm trying to explore the XDC wallet on this part. And as you can see here, when I click on receive, 
uh, we have a total balance of 0xDC at uh, by the time we're recording this video. And we have here options to send and receive XDC, XDCT, XDCE, and Ethereum. And of course, on the send and receive uh, option of our XDC wallet, we have information where we can copy or share our uh, XDC uh, wallet addresses. Okay, So this is the uh, main option that we need in case we're wanting to uh, withdraw or deposit our XDC coins uh, to and from another exchange if we want to uh, take profit and withdraw our XDC uh, coins by the time the XDC will reach its all-time high or, for example, we're on the next major bull run. Now, looking at the other options here, we also have uh, support on stable coins uh, with our XDC wallet. Uh, we have uh, USDC and USDT stable coins also uh, supported by the XDC wallet. Okay, so when I click on the send option here, uh, for example, uh, we're selecting XDC. Uh, make sure, guys, that when you're doing your transactions and you're uh, sending or depositing your XDC, uh, make sure that you select the desired uh, coin or token from the list above, okay? Be before you can uh, push through with the transaction. Otherwise, uh, you may be having problems receiving or uh, sending your XDC coins to and from uh, another exchange, okay? So in this example, we have we clicked on XDC from this XDC wallet address going to uh, another, uh, for example, cryptocurrency exchange. Now, personally, I deposit now, personally, I have XDC holdings on my gate.io cryptocurrency exchange account. So I have an option to withdraw my XDC coin from gate.io and deposit my XDC coins here on my XDC wallet. And then I will hold my XDC here. Uh, by the time I want to take profit on the XDC coin, that's the time that I'm going to uh, withdraw the XDC coin from my XDC wallet and follow the P2P or peer-to-peer -peer process and convert our XDC coin uh, to actual cash by the time or by the right time when XDC is already uh, on the all-time high or we're on a major bull run. And I thank everyone for watching this video and subscribing to our Involved Asia and Cryptocurrency YouTube channel. You can also explore uh, more videos and dedicated videos about XDC coin. Uh, XDC again is part of the ISO 222 compliant cryptocurrencies. And in the about section of our Involved Asia and Cryptocurrency YouTube channel, we have here our description and other income generating business ideas online.